Good morning. Welcome back to the Palms West Presbyterian Church Daily Check-In. My name is Melanie Stepp. I'm the Director of Family Ministries, and I'm actually here at MacArthur State Park on Friday before the beaches close. You know, there's a lot of uncertainty and a lot of businesses closing, and I want to share with you some of the verses, one in particular, Psalm 25.5, which I've really been leaning on. It says this, Guide me in your truth and teach me, for you are God my Savior, and my hope is in you all day long, comma, even in quarantine. You know, this really posed a question to me. Am I open to letting God teach me something during this trial? So I want to put that on you as well this morning. I want to give you an opportunity to ask yourself that question. Are you willing to let God teach you something during this trial? You know, over the next two weeks, two months, or maybe even longer, I really want to look back and say, I let God change me, help me grow during this trial. I'm stronger emotionally. My faith is stronger. You know, we don't like to learn. We don't like to be taught things. Any parents who've been home with their kids know this is true. Sometimes we have to make them sit down to study and to do their lesson, even when they know it's good for them. But there's so many distractions, especially when you're trying to do homeschool right now. Well, friends, don't be distracted. Let God be your teacher. Don't be distracted from the fear, by the fear. Don't be distracted by the news. Let God be your teacher. You know, we have a path to choose right now. We could choose the path of fear and anxiety and let that control our emotions and what we do. Or we could choose the path that God has given us, where he is our teacher and our guide, and he is our hope. Let God teach you something during this trial. Let's pray. God, thank you for being our teacher. Thank you for being with us no matter where we are, no matter where we are in quarantine, whether it's Palm Beach County or somewhere across the world. Lord, I pray that you would be our teacher. Let us sit down and spend time with you, our guide. Direct us through this uncertain time. And it's in Jesus' name we pray. Amen.